Hey guys, and welcome to Spangler Stadium. I'm Brendan Boylan alongside head coach of football, Carol McRae, following a 34-30 loss to North Alabama here this afternoon on Senior Day. Coach, I feel like we talk about it every week, another big step of growth for this young receiving corps. Even in a loss, how satisfied are you seeing growth week to week for guys like Jamison Turner, Devron Harper, and of course Isaiah Gathings? Well, we're having a lot of guys contribute, and um, that's what you want. So um, as we move along, we've had several guys step up, and we got some more guys that are being added to the group that uh, I think will start making plays as we continue to uh, move forward. So uh, pleased with them. I hope we wish we could have gotten that end zone one more time. But uh, they made a lot of plays today and, uh, and did a lot of good things. Coach, uh, defensively, you lose Devin Mines, and that's a big loss. And then you lose McCutcheon during the game. You guys lose Kobe Rogers during the game. You lose Singleton during the game. A lot of injuries hit that defense. Who do you feel stepped up today and really led this defense through all those injuries? Well, I thought they all stepped up. I thought our defensive front played really well, you know, for the most part. Uh, we had a you know, pass rush group that came in and put some pressure on. Then we started getting pressure with our regular front. I thought our linebackers, you know, continued to make plays. You know, and then uh, Damian Williams came in and played uh, most all game. A.J. King stepped up. Uh, we played Deontay Greer at corner. And then, uh, you know, we got young at safety. Had to move Malachi Buckner from kind of outside linebacker to safety, uh, along with LaQuincy Shepard and uh, Jamar Jenkins. So we had two true freshmen and a sophomore. But really three freshmen that we had to end up back there in the back. So got a lot of experience. They made a lot of plays. Uh, you know, some plays got by us. And that's what I told the team. I thought our effort was good. I thought we really fought. The sad part is we left a few plays out there on the grass today. And, uh, you know, we needed those few plays in a tight ball game. It was back and forth. A lot of change in momentum. And uh, we needed one or two more plays. And finally, Coach, senior day here today. Yeah. Uh, you've done this for a few different years now, a few different senior classes. Specifically, what did this senior class mean to you, the uh, the team, and the school, and how do you make sure you honor them as you go and prepare for their final week with the running Bulldogs? Well, we honored them last night and then today with their families, and you know we fought our guts out for them today. I told them I'm really disappointed for those guys that won't be able to pull that red jersey down again. But um, they've had great leadership. They've stuck together. They've hung together, and I expect them to do it seven more days, give us a chance down in Atlanta. We'll pull that white jersey down one more time. We're going to ride with them and, and uh, work really hard to uh, send them out on a good note down there. Well, guys, that's all the time we have from Spangler Stadium. For more information about Coach Carol McRae, his team, as they head on to take on Kennesaw State on Saturday, check out GWSports.com.